You are about to enter into a new world of knowledge, curiosities, and high strangeness. This is a podcast of Straight Up Strange Productions. Tonight, I know I said I was going to do it on the anniversary of the Silver Bridge Collapse, uh, but I forgot. So now, it's the holiday special. Join me for the TNT area Estes Method Session. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the uh, 2020 uh, holiday special. Uh, I'm calling it that because that way you can make it be whatever you need it to be to fit whatever holiday it is. If it's Christmas, you know, Hanukkah, Yule, Kwanzaa, uh, if you're waiting till New Year's Eve to listen to this, or if it's just, you know, happy death to 2020, whatever you need Whatever, whatever holiday you need this uh, to be the special for, it is the special for it. And uh, I'm also doing it just because I wasn't able to get it out before Christmas. And uh, figure out I'll do it in the middle, and then everyone can just make it be whatever they need to be. No, so what this is going to be is very much like the Halloween special. I'm going to play uh, our Estes Method session at the TNT area back... Back in like August or something, I just remember uh, the mosquitoes ripe. They were ready to be harvested because there were many of them. And uh, now, when we go out and do this stuff, we have a mosquito repellent that could kill a large bird. But at the time, we didn't. <laughs> so I think that's actually why we stopped and left was because the mosquitoes were getting pretty bad. It was getting, you know, it was getting to be that time of the day. But, um, it's broken up into a couple of parts, I think three parts, and I'll, I'll come in uh, in between each part and kind of talk about what happened. But what we did was, me and Heather, we went to, or Heather and I, I guess is how you're supposed to say it, went down to uh, to like to Point Pleasant on like uh, like a Sunday or two, so like, a, like a day where no one was going to be there, and uh, went to the TNT area. And did some searching. I don't really know why, but for some reason we were really hell-bent on trying to find a dome that not everyone seems to go to. Not trying to find one that wasn't covered in graffiti or damaged or anything like that. And the way that we kind of stumbled upon it was a rock, really. Uh, we were talking about these. You probably see them all the time. They're these weird kind of uh, rocks that are this kind of ugly brownish green color they look like a peeled potato aka the potato rock and uh we were you know she collects them and a friend that, that heather has collects them and uh we walked into a dome that was kind of off the beaten path like you had to go through some brush and you had to get back there it was a little overgrown and walking in that one in the middle of the dome 
was one of these potato rocks. And that's when we were like, this is our dome. And so that is this is where we did most of the Essie's Method session. In fact, all of them. We started inside. As you'll hear, that doesn't work too well because of the echo and stuff. So we came outside and did it just outside the dome. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to get, I'll, I'll get into it. I'll come back at the end of like each little section, each separate recording that we did and uh, just kind of give you some insight on what was going down. So this is the first recording that we have at the TNT area in Point Pleasant, West Virginia. Get started. All right, so we are at Point Pleasant, West Virginia. We are in the domes. Well, she's in a dome. I'm not in a dome. And we are going to see what we can get. So we are talking to anything that wants to talk. Go right ahead. Is there anybody here? Because I wasn't getting anything but a little blip of like music here and there. Yeah, I know. I'm getting more on AM though. Yeah. Okay, let's try this again. Now that we are on AM. Anyone here? Anything here? Anyone? Right. Right. Right here, right now? Say it once. Say it. Right. No. It's almost a riddle. What am I oh. saying once? Really? Nope. Didn't get it. Can you say it again? End. End. We haven't even started yet. I don't think we're going to end quite yet. Who is this? Are you someone left over from the facility that used to be here? Are you an energy of Indrin Cold, perhaps? Couldn't. Could have been? I don't know. Do you know the name Indrin Cold? Wrong. 
wrong? Stop. No? No, we're not going to stop. Took a long time to get here. Took a long time to talk to you. Four. I bet. Spend all this time out here in a dome. Probably not very excited. Exciting. Right. Right. <laughs> but maybe we can liven it up, at least for today. Give you something to do. You got a name? Why are you here? Chuck. You say Chuck. Who's Chuck? Love to. Did you work here, Chuck? Do you know who Injured Cold is? Do you know? Smooth. Okay. Do you know what the Mothman was? Were you here for that? Come on, we were doing so well. Where did you go? It seems to be a special place to a lot of people. Is this a special place to you? Heavy. Heavy? Heavy how? Does it feel heavy? Heavy in like a physical way? Heavy as in like a depression? Maybe it's me. Maybe I'm just not asking the right things. Are you a human? Were you a human? Are you not human? Are you something else? Some birds doing something. We want to talk. We want to communicate. Where'd you go? Where'd you go, Chuck? Or whatever you want to be called. Heavy in the dome? Come outside. Go. 
Done. Done. Were you military? This is fun. It is a little fun. It's interesting to say the least. Out on the move. I don't know what she said. Then the door. What was that? What about the door? Let me know. You're not going. No, not for probably a little bit. Unless you're trying to warn us not to go somewhere. And if that's the case, where should we not go? I blame... Keep going. I'm listening. Who do you blame? Snap. Took a turn. Everything all right? Something bad happened? Come on, we're getting close. Talking. It's fun, right? Move. Okay, so I've heard move several times and it's just not registered fast enough. But I've heard it like eight okay. times after the fact. You want me to move? Who needs to, move? to move? You want me to come in there? Yep. Okay. Take it. All right. I'm here. to be in the Got dome. Okay. A couple. Five. Sure. All right, I'm going to come back outside because I can't hear. It's very echoey in there. Turn the light on. thought maybe a little light would, okay. would help. I don't know what that was. What hand signal that was.
So this one does start off a little low energy. I think a lot of it was she was just inside of the dome. And like I said, if you can, you can hear right on there that I, I, I'm outside and then I go inside and then I can hear crap and then I come back out. And I think when we just decided to try it just outside the dome, everything worked better. I don't know if just maybe the, the box couldn't get good radio signal from being in there because you know it's just a huge thing of concrete it blocks everything like your phones don't work in there barely or any of that jazz so the second part i think yeah we we tried it again and we just kind of camped out you know maybe what eight ten feet away from the entrance of the dome and uh, we gave it another go and i think had had a lot more luck with it so that's the end of that one and then we regrouped, went outside, and we started again. Won't come out. Oh, now you're not going to come out. We came out. We moved. I can hear you. Damn. Can't. Time. Time for what? Escape. To escape. All you gotta do is leave, right? Or we can help. Still talking to Chuck? You think? Escape. Escape. Who needs to escape? You or us? Take the time. Take the time. Imprison. Do you feel like you're in a prison? Wherever you are right now? Change my feelings. Came through. What? I'm jealous. Who's jealous? I'm curious. I'm curious about what goes on here. Turn on his back. What you mean by that? Burns, burns, burns. You don't sound like you're having a good time. Prison, burning. What's going on over there? Take.
had a broken hand. Broken hand. An accident? That I made it. All right. Did someone have to turn you on your back to help you out? Oh, right in there. Angels. Angels. Mothman. Things with wings. What this area is known for. Dogs barking. What about angels? Have you seen angels? Let your hair down. I'm almost bald. My hair's down about as low as it's going to go. On with it. Never go. Well, we can't stay here forever. It doesn't take long to get here, though. We can come back. To be... To be what? Story of the summer. Summer of 66? Before that. When this place was still active. Open. Open what? Dome's open. They're all open. Anything else? Knows that. <laughs> okay. So you know the area. You just hop from dome to dome, checking them out. Went in their house. They were good girls. Were they? Kind of concerned about that. That was funny. What was funny? I'm concerned. Tell me more about these girls. A hundred and seven. Temperature? Is it a we hot tried. Day of the summer. Hundred and seven. Breeze? Is it that hot in West Virginia? The moon tonight. Is the moon tonight going to be a quarter like moon? A 
think so. Make it a little smaller. <laughs> Maybe it's a light quarter. Trying to. What are you trying to do? Trying to communicate? Trying to make the moon smaller? Lost. Well, I bet you do. A little lost. Why are you here? Why are you at this place? At this dome? Cover. Is it a cover? Is it safety? Mid eighties. Mid eighties. This. The child will be. <laughs> is, this, is this the thing we've been calling the person that we've been calling Chuck? Or is this somebody else? So important about the moon tonight. You like the moon? Continue to be a challenge for. I don't know what you mean. I don't know where to go with that one. Was it hard to come out? Dancing. Dancing. Did these girls used to dance? I know. I know what? Tell me Defeated. what. Defeated. I know. Starting out. Trailed off starting out. Say it again. Went down. They were done. From Kenny. Tell me more about Kenny. Is this Kenny? From Kenny. The city. Which one? Point Pleasant? Not really a city. Really polis? Still a coffee? This oh. by the fourth. So it's by the fourth. Is that like an order? A military order? Did you have to have something done by the fourth? Fourth of July in the summer. It's the one. Yeah. What'd you have to get done by the fourth? So much. So much? Had to get so much done? What specifically did you have to get done? What was the task?
He's angel and me. Be right. Kenny's angel? Is that what was from Kenny? I'm always alive. Are you? You're always here, right? Was it this dome? Or just the entire area? How far can you go? Math. What? This is taking long. It is taking long. Sometimes it takes a long time. The better we can understand you, the more progress we can make. I can do it. Can you? Come on, talk. Who was Kenny? Is Kenny a friend? Is Kenny a relative? Employee, like a fellow employee. Can he die in a car accident in the 80s? You said you could do it. Come on. Won't be gone. There's no one here. Got me forever. Hmm. I'm pretty sad. Did everyone else move on? And you're left here? Good for you. It seems I've touched on something. Where'd everybody else go? Why are you still here? Why do you think you're still here? It's your turn to survive. I get it, but you have to survive out here all by yourself. Apparently you've done it for quite a long time. But why, why are you out here by yourself? What's your name? My name is Fred. Her name is Heather. I guess we never said hi. We just kind of jumped into this, didn't we? But yeah, those are our names. Now that I know that. <laughs> What's yours? Kenny? Chuck? Does Chuck know Kenny? Now with you a little bit later on. Mm. Well, later. Only be here for so long. It's getting dark. Me. Me. Right through. Do you want us to wait until dark? Talking about the moon sticking no. around. No. Do you Yours. Want to stay? I don't like the dark. Maybe you don't like the moon. Maybe. Maybe you don't like the moon. It'll be out pretty soon.
keep hearing She's All Country by Jason Aldean. I don't think that's anything. Or maybe that's everything. Key to it all. Losing you, huh? Idle spirit. I mean, I guess that's what I would describe you as. Someone who's just kind of idling around. Nothing wrong with that. Suit worn. It is pretty worn. Very muggy. And again. Mm hmm. Just heard another move. Moved a little bit. It's still here, though. Sure. Sure what? I'll stick around for a little bit, I think. Is that okay? Leave. Do you want to see? Because a little bit ago you didn't. Or are you trying to leave? Sure. No. No. Sure, you want us to leave. No, I don't want to leave. Is he bothering you? You want us to leave, yes or no? In the something. Mm. You're in my arms. Mm. It's just when I think that it's done, it comes back. My world. Here. You want us to stay, you want us to go, you just gotta give us the word. We have to be able to understand you. On schedule. <laughs> Lifted. On schedule for what? 
on the neck. Fourth of July. I'm going to give you another minute, and then I think I'm going to tap her on the okay. shoulder. I think you're about done with this. Are we annoying you? Oh, my goodness. Hello. Trying to find out. You're trying to find out too. What are you trying to find out? We want. What do we want? Or what do you want? I thought you said, what do we want? I just want to know what's going on. Mary is a little bit of a different place. See if you don't. Try some. Do you want us to switch? Mean it. We'll continue. We can continue. Just think about maybe switching up. Maybe you can talk to me for a little bit. Or talk through me. Think about that. Give you a ride. Our backs against cars and stuff. Give who a ride? Useful. I don't know, I'm not following. All right. I'm going to give us until half an hour. It's two minutes. And I think we're going to switch out. Anything else you want to say? Who's Kenny? Let's go back to Kenny. Can't. Why can't you? 
a painful memory. You not want to talk about Kenny's? There's a reason you can't talk about Kenny's. My heart. Fighting for. What do you mean? Interesting. By, what's interesting? This process? This way of being? That crazy ride. So, what? Say that one more time. That's it. That's it. That was probably the key to the whole thing, and I missed it. We're gonna wouldn't we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Reach out. See what happens. Feel like it. Okay. Oh, right. Ah, got a lot darker. Okay. Like heavy pain bugs. Oh, are they coming through here? No, they're over there. But man, you can hear yeah. the guy. Aboo. You can hear them yipping and yelling over there. Oh, Lord. The dog's going. Oh, no. Okay. So, yeah. I don't know. I get strings of things that kind of make sense, you know? Yeah. And then they just. And then everything just stops. Yeah, I know. I noticed like, that. You started talking. Okay, so is mine still recording though, right? Yeah. So for the record, do you remember when you were making sound recordings and trying to figure out the, the echo and how it would affect everything? Yes. And you were making that, or like, yeah. No, it was a, it was a, yeah, or yeah, some, yeah, something yeah. of that yeah. nature. I, so while you were gone, when you went back to the Jeep to get the bug spray and everything, mm -hmm. I kept hearing that. I was sitting, I was still sitting where I was, wasn't moving, wasn't even vaping. And I kept hearing that. I heard it like two or three times. I tried to record it on that one. Yeah. Never caught it. Hmm. I heard that like two or three times, but without reference, you wouldn't have understand. You wouldn't have understood. Yeah. So yeah, that makes sense. I didn't, that's why I didn't call it out, but I kept noticing it. it oh my God, six, seven times at least. I want to look. I can't remember how it went. Okay, it was all the Kenny up. stuff started. Yeah. I remember Ouch. doing this like when I started my episode. Popping my hair. Bert told me to take my hair down. Oh yeah, that about that too. Yeah. Um, so in the second part there, it's it's another one of those instances where it just feels like there's at least. Two people, two entities, something, trying to get stuff across. Um, two different stories going on and trying to suss out which one is which. And some, you know, interesting stuff with the, you know, the stuff that happened when I, I did leave. I went to the Jeep to go get uh, bug spray. Not the good stuff, like I said earlier, the terrible stuff. And uh, she was just there. And recorded some stuff, uh, some some interesting things going on, but not quite enough to really put a strong narrative together. So then, right before we left, right before the bugs got uh, so terrible that we just couldn't stay anymore, 
I decided to jump in, and uh, we finished out with me in the Estes Method session. So here is the third and final part to uh, the Estes Method session at the TNT Dome. All right, we switch. What do you want to say to him that you can't say to me? Don't you know what's new? No, I don't know what's new. Why don't you tell me? Fine. What's fine? Or fine you're going to tell me? You got super talkative with me there for a little while. Why not him? Well. Well, what? Coming back. I was going to come back. Do you want me to come back? Do you have nothing to say to him? Or do you want me to come back inside? What will you do? I'd probably sit and just listen again. Do you want me to come back inside? something else coming back. Are we scared? I'm not scared. I don't believe Fred is scared. Is there a reason why we should be? I don't think he was comforted by your little story. Do you want to say more on the subject? Or do you think I'm too scared to come inside now? Are you too scared to answer my questions? There's something very slight, just on the edge. Is there somebody else trying to break through? 
somebody else want to talk with? Are you blocking said somebody from talking though? Hey. Hi. What? Personal okay. bank. What about a personal bank? Did somebody rob a personal bank? Tonight. What about tonight? It is getting to be night. What happens tonight? Did something spectacular happen tonight? Should we stay? He was a brave one. Who was? Help me? Help you with what? What do you need help with? This is where the road leads, something like that. Yeah, I mean, it's part deer trail, but yeah, this is where the road led us. First floor? It is a one floor building. First floor of a hotel. First floor of a house. On the highway. On the highway. Which highway? Where are you going? North, south, east, west. Never be. Never be. No. Never be what? No. Never be on the highway? Were you trying to get to the highway? Sleep. You want sleep? You want us to sleep here? What? Have you been sleeping? No. Okay. So you've been awake this whole time. Completely cognizant. What brought you here? One more. One more what? Step? 
one more person, one more time, one more thing. A lot. Yes, there are a lot of mosquitoes. Exactly what I was just thinking. We forgot. We forgot. We've been forgotten. You forgot something. We forgot to pack something. Didn't forget the bug spray. Obviously, that's why it's dripping. Why not? Probably because it's a very shitty bug spray. And the entire bottle is a lie. Do it. Do what? Spray it again? Obviously, it wasn't very effective. Out. Out. Out, out what? Out of what? Out of range. You want it just out of here? It's mine now. Oh, yeah, it's your space. You're more than welcome to it. I just want to know why you're here. Getting to it. Okay, so get to it. Tell me. More than that. More than what? Being chased here? How low? Be hallowed. You was someone something. Is this hallowed ground for you? Have you been here before you died here? <laughs> or before your spirit came here? Did you used to party here? Mm. Sound like Harold, the name Harold. Harold a name. Harold a newspaper. Two Harolds. Are you trying to tell us something? Or was that your name? Nope. Okay, not your name. Somebody else's name. Did you do something to Harold? Did Harold do something to you? Tell me about Harold. Short man, tall man, fat man, skinny man. Help. Help with what? One day. He's been out here about a day. I was sitting. You were sitting where? Sitting doing what?
these streets. It looks like these were at one point a paved path. To each individual dome. What about these streets? Were these the streets that you worked on? This was a little government base type thing. It had multiple yeah. buildings that were eventually flooded. What about these streets? Where did they lead? What did they mean to you? Getting there. Okay. I'm getting there in like a cold and hot kind of situation. Okay. So you lived around here. You had family around here? Time. Time to do what? In the end, maybe? In the end of what? Did you come here in the end? Why? Like that was stupid. What was stupid? Mm. A new one? Or maybe New York. What about New York? Were you from New York? That's it. Okay. You were from New York. Why were you in West Virginia? Why did you come to West Virginia? That was weird. Mm. No, that's right. That was me saying that was weird. What did you do to Fred to make him say that was weird? Don't lose it. Don't lose what? Not want me to move? Right here? Don't lose what? What am I going to lose? Is something falling out of my backpack? Tuba. Okay, tube of something. What happened in New York? City? Never mind. Never mind what? Yeah. Found a good one. In New York or here? Found a good one. What? What was a good one? A good spot? Did you not want me to move? Nope. Okay. Walk around it. I plan on walking around the guns and the dogs. Okay. 
And we did walk around. I got it. it. You got it. You're going to take care of it. How are you going to take care of it? How do you have it? That sounds like a bad word. Anything I need, I gotta keep trying to get into it. Maybe. Maybe. The end. Yes, the end. But you won't tell me about it. No. Why not? Why won't you tell me about the end? Rodney. What about Rodney? You never did tell me about Harold. Who's Rodney? Are you Rodney? That's mine. Wait. Hmm. That's yours. Okay, so you're Rodney. Rodney what? How'd you get here, Rodney? I'll go away. You'll go away where? Or did you come away to here? Did something happen to Harold in New York that made you come here? Ready for class? Were you a student? Did you come here from New York to go to school? Oh, man. A McDonald's commercial. That's actually pretty relevant as the inside of this dome on the left hand right. side of the wall has a smiley face. And when we first came into this dome, I hummed the McDonald's theme song, actually. I'm loving it. Another McDonald's commercial. What about McDonald's? You know what? Actually, I think. Hmm. Yeah, she... I don't think you're that close. Yeah. I'm getting eaten alive. I know. <laughs> Sprayed directly out of bow. <laughs> oh. Let's make it let's make it really hard for me to Yeah, I know. Hang on. I don't think you know how this is supposed to go. All right. Well, I like to miss from further away because it makes it... Yeah, it makes sense. Good. It also does the area. Yeah. So, the McDonald's theme song, do you remember what happened when we first got to this one? Uh, There's only the smiley face on uh -huh. that inside of that left wall. Yeah. And I did the McDonald's theme song. Oh, yeah, you did. But, like, it was very much like, yeah, they were just clearly McDonald's commercials. Yeah. Two different ones. 
Like it wasn't like yeah. the same one. But still, like, I even said that on the recording. Right. That's right. So, some very interesting things. Really? Yes. Apparently, oh, my mouth. Rodney is yeah. the one we've been talking to. Something about a gentleman named Harold. Yeah, that was pretty clear. Rodney is from New York. Mm -hmm. um, I think he came down here for school. Or with the, or yeah, like, or maybe trained down here when this was or whatever it was. Something, yeah. Mm -hmm. But yeah, there was some very clear, I even asked, is your name Harold? And you immediately, like, no. <laughs> yeah, I remember saying no a couple of times. Yeah, you yeah. answered quite a few questions. And so, uh, there you have it. That was our time at the TNT area, and as soon as everything is back to normal, uh, I definitely want to go back. It is, not only is it just like, it's actually quite beautiful, because it's, you know, they've, they've, they've flooded it and made it part of the wildlife area and stuff, so you're walking on this, you know, path that's still kind of paved, and I don't know what it is, every 50 yards, something like that, there's a dome. But then, like, everything else is just, like, flooded, you know, square ponds of swamp, just all sorts of wildlife, uh, great pictures to be taken. Uh, we came across a one-legged goose while we were walking around. Uh, no, no, just a very, it is a very liminal kind of out-of-the-way place. That is that does have a great vibe to it, uh, a very mysterious vibe, and uh, I don't know what to make of the stuff, the answers that we got and the questions that we got, but it was it was one of the more interesting. Like it was the first time we got to go and kind of do the Essie's Method session at like a big kind of well known place to everybody. So that was it. That was the whole thing, and I would like. To know if anyone has any information on this. Uh, there is one dome that I know of. Because we found it. That is like it's destroyed. It doesn't have a top to it. I don't know if it blew up. I don't know if it collapsed or what. But these things are made like. They are made to last. Like they are just you know. I don't know how many feet thick of just solid concrete. So for one to not. To, for one to be like half gone. Something had to have happened. And, like, I did some searches on, like, newspapers.com and this, that, and the other and wasn't able to find anything. But I would love to know if anyone around the area knows of if one of those ever blew up or, like, why is that one damaged? I think maybe some of the things that we were talking to were around uh, when that happened. And I just, I would love to figure it out. So if anyone has any leads on why that one that one dome is essentially half gone uh please reach out to me uh you know the social media is at sds cast on uh facebook and twitter and at sds cast dot gram or you can you can use the email form at the bottom of the main page on uh, sds cast dot com but that's it that is all i've got i am out of here uh, until the main show next week and if you're on patreon i've got an episode coming out uh, this weekend, the weekend after Christmas, as planned. So thanks for listening. Uh, have a great holiday. Stay safe. Stay healthy. And uh, once again, thanks for listening. Goodbye.